In this video, I go over how to test an Ethernet cable plugged into a Cisco port. When would you want to use this command? Anytime you'd want to test a copper cable, like a Category 5 cable, you use this tool. This tool is called a Time Domain Reflectometer. It's a tool that's used to find faults in metallic cables. And for this video, there are two different commands that we're going to use that are built into pretty much every version of Cisco IOS. The first command is test cable diagnostics TDR, and the second command is show test cable diagnostics TDR. In both of these commands, we need to indicate which interface we're running the test on. Okay, here we go. We have a switch here, and we're going to go ahead and evaluate this interface here. We see right now that this interface is currently showing that it's down. So let's take a quick look at it. Um, and we see that it's a Ethernet port, but it's also a PoE port. And right now, it's a port that is just showing an IEEE PD device. Basically, it's telling us that there's a device on there that is pulling power, but there's nothing currently connected to it. So let's do something to this. This is a port that I actually know is bad, or the cable is bad, I should say. And so with this cable, we're going to just run it so you can see what a test result looks like on a cable that is bad. So, all right, I just turned the interface off and back on. So we should have some information now on that port. So if we go and look at it, let's take a look. It still says that it's down. Let's go ahead and try to run the cable test here. So to run that cable test command, we should type in test cable, TDR, and then interface name. And one thing that you'll see after we run the cable test is a quick little comment here telling us to wait a few seconds before we look at the results of the test. So let's go ahead and also I'll just mention that the full command is actually test cable dash diagnostics. You can just type in cable though for a short. Uh, same thing with the, when you want to see the results, when you want to look at show, you just type in show cable TDR and then the interface name. Let's go ahead and look. So now when we look at this cable, we and like I said, I know that this cable is bad. We can see that there is a problem plus or minus 10 meters out and it's telling us that that pair pair A is open so there's something wrong with that pair on that cable but the other wires the other pairs that make up the category 5 cable are normal and they appear to be working correctly so let's take a look at a cable that is working correctly Okay, and we can look at port 11 here. So let's go ahead and do test again on port 11 so you can see what it looks like on a port that is working correctly or that has a cable that is working correctly on it. There we go. So we can see right now on this cable that is working appropriately we can see basically how long the cable is and we see that the pair status is normal all the pairs are normal all the cable lengths are the same size typically you want to see that with the cables that all these would be the same size so it gives us an idea of how long the cable is as well all right that's all there's to it thanks for watching